Hey guys, and today I am going to be continuing Emily is Away 3, or Heart, however you want to pronounce it. It's the third one in the series. Um, now, I just want to say, before we get started here, it's been a while. <laughs> um, see, I, I always do this. Like, Turmoil is where you can see it the most. I start series, or like I start projects that I want to do. And then I go into my little, like, you know, YouTube break thing that I always do. And, you know, that causes an issue because I have to put the series or the project on hold. <laughs> the first episode of this series was on April 20th. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I just want to say really quickly, uh, before we start, um, oh, I'm really trying to, you know, not do that. But every time I say I'm trying to work on you know, uploading more, it doesn't get very far because I've just got so much going on in my life, especially right now. You know, it's really hard to balance time for YouTube. I love YouTube so much, but it's just pretty hard to balance time for it. But believe me, I am trying. So, um, yeah, I just wanted to say sorry about the whole timeline thing. <laughs> I listened to just like a chunk of the video and it was talking about map testing. <laughs> that was the end of my eighth grade year. I'm literally like almost halfway through ninth grade now. That's terrible. That like you never realize just how long, you know, April to December is because I'm recording this on December 2nd. But like that's terrible. I'm so sorry, guys. Like I, I genuinely am. Um, anyway, though, uh, let's just get started. It's been a while, so I'm excited to get back into it. Oh, God, that kind of scared me. Here we are. Now, one thing that will probably surprise probably all of you is I still have the background. <laughs> I never changed the background back, so we still have the Emily's Away background. You know, that they gave me when I set up the game. Um, so yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, it's been a while, so, uh, what it all exactly did, like, entailed in that. Right, we, we went to a campfire thing. The, the pictures. Uh, we were gonna get your ass kicked in Mario Kart. That did happen. <laughs> Days are getting shorter. You chose to attend Emily's end of summer thing. Thankfully, there's only one person. There's only one party this Halloween, and it's at Matt's. Uh, all right. Oh, whoa. Okay. Oh, sorry. <laughs> getting sidetracked again. Now I can't remember. Was did this game? Yeah, this game very much so weirds out if you full screen it. Uh, ugh, right. Okay, anyway, uh, let's just get started. Saturday, October 18th, 2008. This is really loud, I gotta turn this down. Uh, whoa, just a little, oh my god, just a little insight will make this right. It's too late to fight. It ends tonight, it ends tonight. Psst, Halloween party at my place, don't forget your costume. Uh, okay, very enough stalling, right. Um, post back. You best prepare your ass, because it is the one that will be kicked. Right, okay. Um. Oh, okay. Uh, hey. Here, let me move this cursor. Uh, what up? Uh, not much, you. I was hanging with Kelly, but she left. Oh, cool, how is she? Oh, she's good. She got a new camera for her birthday. We walked around, and she took so many pictures, lol. <laughs> no offense, she needs a better model. <laughs> lol, oh, I know. I think she's stressed about her portfolio and photo school. Didn't know she applied. Photography school, wow. 
Yeah, in Boston, but she doesn't think she'll get it. But she's like actually a good photographer. That's what I keep saying, but then she's just like... Matt, you don't know anything about photography. You don't need to know anything to appreciate it. Oh, what if her shit is actually garbage or it's like, nah, this is great. We're not that dumb. Almost forgot. I found the best picture of you on Kelly's phone. This can only be bad. Oh lord. The act of what? <laughs> Wait, so which character am I again in the storyline here? Right. <laughs> I played the fifth. Whatever you're doing, it worked. <laughs> Good lord. So what? You're having a game night together? Creeping hard, huh? I'll be your wingman at my Halloween party. No thanks. Emily is like such a great catch. Now you should actually shut the fuck up. Sorry, sometimes I, uh, don't, like, read all the dialogue, sorry. Uh. Speaking of first online, I'll let you focus. Okay. You just saved me from Matt, lol. How are you? Now I'm laughing at your pain. Hey, you you replied to my wall post challenge? Come on, Emily, pay attention. It's so important. You accepted? Oh, it's on. Well, prepare my ass. What a smooth comeback. Why, thank you. I thought it was smooth. <laughs> So you come over tomorrow night? Sounds like a plan. Yeah, he said he just found it. It's from my party. It was such a fun night. Thanks again for the invite. Of course, what's a party without Brayden? A party? <laughs> Watching the fireworks and stargazing with you is nice. That was really nice. I'm super deep. Yeah, whatever. I know you like new punk shit. I just updated my playlist if you want to listen. They still have these links? Um, copyright. <laughs> Wow, they updated the YouTube website. Nice. I should not. What does he mean he caught you? He, he just thinks he's funny, but he's not. <laughs> I kind of noticed that you were up to something, too. And what would that be? You're running 
interference between me and Brad like a pro. Thank you for doing that. Oh god, I hit the wrong button. Boxing out access is what friends are for. I really didn't want him to come. Why did you invite him then? I don't know. I felt bad. I think I'm just a people pleaser like to a fault. Yeah. I like personally in real life, I definitely do way too much, you know, for others and not myself. How do you deal with that impulse? Uh, I don't all that well. Here's the thing, like, I don't know, I just, I guess I kind of, you know, I always want to make other people happy. I mean, that's part of YouTube, and I like seeing other people happy. Like, it makes me happy. I guess it's just kind of a way that I find, you know, happiness. Plus, I'm pretty sure he likes me, which just makes me feel even worse. Even if he does, you don't owe him anything. No, I know that, and I don't feel like I do. Like, all the kid does is agree with me about everything. Is that even a personality? A personality? Nope, definitely not. I wish you would just take a hint. I would say mage need a stronger hint, but that's not always the solution. You may need a stronger hint, that's all. A stronger hint like what? You could try just not talking to him. I don't know if that would end well. Yeah. Sorry, I didn't mean to get into all of this. Hey, no problem at all. Thanks for being there for me, Brayden. I'm glad you and Matt came to the party. I wouldn't have missed it for anything. Oh boy. <laughs> I hope you like virtual cake. Uh, hey, I almost forgot to ask you. Uh, ask me what? Have you heard the new Kings of Leon album yet? Only by the night? Uh, I don't think so. I added it into my indie playlist. Let's sync it up and listen to it together. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now, how exactly do you go about doing that? It's pretty good. There's other stuff on the playlist, too. Uh, oh! Playlist. Yeah, I see. Uh, I'm not gonna listen to all of them, but... Oh. Hey, Evelyn, I hope you can come to Matt's party. It should be fun. Tons of people will be there. Uh, have you picked out your costume for Matt's party yet? Um... Haven't thought about it. Oh no, what's the game gonna make me choose? I picked out mine this week, did you see? Uh, Tinkerbell, right? I saw the profile picture. I even got a magic wand. But I wanted to ask you if you'd dress up with me. Uh, what goes with your costume? Haha, I don't know, uh... Something else for Peter Pan, I guess? Uh, what would you suggest? If there's an option, I'll also be Tinkerbell. 
I think you'd make for a great Peter Pan. Uh, sounds good to me. I'm so excited for Matt's party now. I'm excited too. Oh man, so I'm doing one of those note survey things. And this memory it's making me re relive is so fucking embarrassing. <laughs> sure it's not that bad. I don't know, Braden. You might think it'd be less if I told you. Uh, come on, Emily. You know that wouldn't happen. So it's asking about life, formative memories. I don't know why, but this one memory from middle school stuck out to me for some reason. It was like I was having baby's first existential crisis or something. Whoa, how are mirrors real if our eyes aren't even real? <laughs> okay, not quite that level, but pretty fucking stupid. <laughs> And oh god, are the details of that night, like, peak teenage angst. I already know this is gonna be good. It was like past midnight and I snuck out onto my roof with my iPod. I was listening to music and just looking at the sky. You aren't lying, that's some heavy angst right there. Thank you, puberty. The worst part is now anytime I hear a certain song, I get so emotional. Now you have to tell me. It was uh, Nickelback. Uh, who are they again? I know who they are. I just chose that. I almost don't want to send you this link. What? What? <laughs> Why did it just open Google? <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh no, the game's link is broken! No! <laughs> what the heck? Why is it just redirecting me to Google? <laughs> what in the world? That's... weird. <laughs> the other two links worked. What? Uh... Uh-oh. Oh, okay. Here, hold on. I might be able to fix it myself. Oh, Lord. Oh, got it. <laughs> I just I just typed in the thing here in the URL. Uh, <laughs> nothing against uh, Nickelback, but... No, I know. Happy almost birthday, baby. Don't worry. I totes would have remembered even if Face Talk didn't tell me. Uh, breaking down and crying to them isn't exactly the appropriate response. You just gotta own up. You just gotta own it and cry all you want. Well, thanks for talking with me, Brayden. And getting deep about random shit. Hey, no worries. It's my pleasure. Flood is slowly rising up, swallowing the ground beneath my feet. Tell me how anyone thinks under this condition, so. You know you're a good person. I don't care what anyone else says. Wait, they, everyone else says things? Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, you should so do this survey too. Um... I don't know. Sounds like a lot of work. It says at the bottom if I tag you and you don't do it. You'll get seven years of bad luck. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm not superstitious like that. Well, neither am I, but you should still do this note. <sighs> Bring on the questions. <laughs> Hell yeah. 
Well, while you do that, I'm gonna go make some tea. <laughs> Does that mean you're ditching me? I wouldn't say ditching, but uh, yeah. Be right back. Fine. Bye, Emily. Hey, no buys, never buys. I have a pet peeve with those. Plus, I'm kind of hoping you stick around for a while. Super secret note survey. Uh. What do people call you? They call me Raiden? Are your nails currently pa uh, painted? Uh, no. <laughs> do you know someone who's always on their phone? Not really me. <laughs> What can you hear right now? This shitty computer. <laughs> Last person that wrote on your wall. What does their name rhyme with? Who is the last person? Will this clear if I go back? Evelyn. Oh, that wasn't my wall. Okay, yeah. That's my wall. So, do I lose my my note now? Do I have to start over? Oh, okay, no. Evident <laughs> felon. <laughs> Not that they're a felon, or maybe they are. Are you and that person friends, acquaintances, something else? What's the last thing you put in your mouth? <laughs> Ugh. Your mama! It's delicious home cooking. <laughs> What's best? Having good friends, a best friend, or a girlfriend, boyfriend? Um. Good friends. The last person you message, first two letters of their name E and M. Wonder who that could be. Are you and this person alike? I I am way cooler, but other than that, we're pretty similar. You ever say the word word fuck? Um, yeah. <laughs> uh, I <laughs> I say fuck like every other fucking other fucking sentence. Fuck. There goes the PG rating. <laughs> um, most important childhood memory. I've never done anything like that, just like stargazing or any of the, you know, embarrassing stuff, but, uh, I feel like, you know, sometime I need to just lay down and just think about things. I've just got so much on my mind all the time. Do you have a crush on anyone mentioned in this note? Um, I like to plead the fifth on the grounds that my answer may incriminate me. <laughs> But wait, 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 wait. I have to back. Hey, hey. I have to read yours. Elephant Venom? Best friends and partners come and go, but good friends are forever. B and R. <laughs> I guess so. They're pretty okay. I mean, not at first, obviously. Hey. You're gonna get me in trouble. Uh. Hey. What are you up to? Uh. I'm just chilling. Just raided my mom's liquor cabinet. Be careful not to drink too much. Don't worry, I'll be fine. Yeah, that's what they all say. So did you have a chance to listen to that playlist I sent? I sent. Uh, yeah, of course I did. 
So what was your favorite song? Uh, I'll have to recall what this playlist was. Right, because I didn't realize that the there was actually like playlists with multiple songs. Hold on. What in the world is going on in this music video? <laughs> I don't really have a whole ton of a music opinion. Thanks for listening to it. Of course. I did listen to all of them. I just, like I said, I don't have a ton of a, you know, music opinion or anything. Oh, look, I'm in your note. Uh, oh yeah. Well, you posted on my wall last. Is it weird for a second I thought you were going to say we weren't friends? But why would I say that? I don't know, it was just a thought. Something going on? You're just so different now, it's crazy. Mm. Sorry. <laughs> so I'm just been like super distant. I guess I've just been busy. Not just lately, like you didn't come to my summer party. You said you might be able to make it. But I saw the pictures. I know you just went to Emily's. <sighs> it was Matt's choice where we went. It just sucked. Since then, we've talked less and less. I'm sorry. If I have been, it's not intentional. It's okay, but like you get it. I know you and Emily are close now. That's really not what this is about. I don't know, I'm just saying it makes sense for you to be distant, I guess. Honestly, I don't know what I'm saying. Yeah, I'm fine. This isn't why I wanted to message you anyways. Sorry if I derailed the conversation. My fault. So, uh, have you noticed Matt acting weird lately? I guess so, but he's always acting weird. I don't know what's going on. He, like, came on to me yesterday. What? He just started being really flirty over Facebook chat. Telling me stuff like, if only he was single. Ugh. And he wasn't joking? Pretty positive. I just wanted to warn you because, like, I see the way he talks to Emily, too. What are you trying to say with that? Just be careful around him. And please don't tell him I said anything. He's dumb, but he's still like my friend. Yeah, of course not. I guess I should probably go. You don't have to. It's okay, bye. <sighs> Kelly is thanks for the birthday wishes. Guess who's back? Uh, Eminem. <laughs> Nope. 
just me. So how's your cup of tea? This night's a perfect shade of dark blue, dark blue. Have you ever been alone in a crowded room? This tea is my cup of tea. Roll laugh track. Encore, encore. Oh shit, you posted the note. No bad luck for me. Did you read mine too? Every word. So learn anything interest interesting about me? You just started to swear? <laughs> hey, I grew up in a wholesome household. Do you have a crush on someone? Shh, that's like a super secret thing. I'll find out eventually, so why not say now? I just finished reading your answers. Be gentle. <laughs> your mama's delicious house cooking. <laughs> Master of comedy. Oh, and you plead the fifth? How incriminating! Not so loud. <laughs> So it's a secret. Ah, uh, don't forget our costume I remember our costume idea. Don't forget to get your half. I'll look silly dressed up alone. I'm learning a lot here. Ah, uh, is that a good or bad thing? Oh, it's bad. Definitely bad. <laughs> Just good friends over a relationship. Friends are more definitely more important. I completely and totally agree. What's that famous saying? Bros before hoes. We're bros in this scenario. I'm a bro. You a hoe. Aha. Uh -huh. Would you think less of me if I told you I live by that motto? Of course not. I knew I liked you. I lost my best friend once to her shitty boyfriend. That shit ain't happening again. I don't think I know this story. It's just dumb high school shit. Turns out I'm dumb. I don't really trust that summary because you're in no way dumb. So, I don't mind talking about this with you because we're close, but first, can I ask you something? Of course. In your note, you said that you and Eve Evelyn's were friends. <laughs> in your note, you said that you and Evelyn were friends. Did you mean that? I don't know. Not really close or anything. Okay, I was just wondering. But do you two, like, talk a lot? Not a lot. Never about anything really important. Cool, I just don't want anything I say getting, like, back to her. You know me, Emily, I wouldn't do that. I don't really know where to begin. Just start rambling, I've got time. I don't have anywhere to be. Well, actually, <laughs> it's getting a little late. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> Okay, I guess me and Evelyn started drifting apart like junior year, but it was just minor stuff like her drinking and me not. And she was mad about your choices? Not mad, we didn't talk about it. It just created some distance between us, you know? Yeah, I can see that.
And then she met Travis and everything changed. Suddenly she was sneaking out, smoking all of this shit. Was she like trying to impress him? Whatever she was trying to do, Travis just had her wrapped around his finger. Do you ever just try talking to her about it? I did. And that's when it all went to shit. What did you end up saying to her? Everything. Did she was changing that Travis was controlling? But this part, well, I'm pretty ashamed of. I kind of told her it was either me or him. There's no way that could have ended well. That's pathetic, and it ended up destroying us. What we are now is all my fault. The whole me or him thing is not the best thing to say, but talking to her was a good thing. Because stuff like that doesn't matter if you're trying to impress someone in the moment. That's really going to come back and bite you in the ass. And I know this is just coming from a stupid little 14-year-old freshman, but believe me. um, I, I've seen stuff happen, and I... Despite me never actually being in a relationship, fun fact, like I've never ever dated anyone before, I... I know more than you'd expect. And not just relationship, that wasn't really what we were talking about, just life in general. I've never done anything bad like that, like, I've never gotten drunk or done any drugs or anything. Which, you'd be surprised how good that is in this generation. Um, sorry, getting off track. I think it's naive to think like that. What would you have done if you were me? I would have talked to her, but I really wouldn't have, you know, said me or him. I wouldn't have talked to the to Travis, because it's not involving him. Well, it is, but it's not. Yeah. <laughs> Probably the exact same thing. Uh, a mix of it. I guess we have similar flaws. Eventually her and Travis ended, but now me and Evelyn are here, and this- and here fucking sucks. Is she, like, avoiding you? Not really avoiding, but things aren't exactly easy. And it's gonna make me sound like a jerk, but a lot of that's on me. What do you mean? Like, I haven't exactly been welcoming. I don't know, maybe I'm a bad person. Like, I'm sure you've seen our wall posts. I've seen them, but I definitely don't understand them. They're just lyrics from songs we found together. That's all the interaction I've allowed for months. That's all you said back there? Yep, that's it. Pathetic, I know. Like, I want to go back to how we were, if that's possible. I'm just afraid of getting burned again. And given what happened, that makes complete sense. I just don't know what to do. What do you think? The world could be burning down, burning down. Um. I bet Evelyn just feels guilty and doesn't know how to go about making things right. Well, I should have, I should have pressed you both to blame. Be right. 
don't know, I just, I kind of just want my best friend back. What should I do? I can get her back. Just tell her that. And if talking to her doesn't help anything, then it's all on her, not you. The past is the past, but the future is what you can control. Okay, I'll try to meet up with her and talk. It'll be good for you, Emily, I promise. Hey, Evelyn, do you have time to, like, talk after school sometime this week? I won't lie, it's really sucked not having a, like, best friend this year. But we're pretty close now, so it may have been worth it. Yeah, I guess you're pretty cool. Plus, you're kind of amazing to talk about shit like this. Thanks, Emily, I do try. I'm sorry if I look ruined your night. Are you kidding? Talking with you definitely made my night better. God, sorry. I, I press enter too early sometimes. So then I have to look down because I start freaking out because, you know, I wasn't able to send the message. And it obviously made my night better too. But for real, thanks for listening. It means a lot. Anytime, you know, I'm always here. Okay, really important question time. It's always C. Which character do you play in Mario Kart? Because Toad is my guy, and you ain't taking him. I respect that. I'll pick Luigi. I guess he does suit you. <laughs> no more than Toad suits you. You know what? I'm gonna take that as a compliment. Should we make this more interesting and bet on who wins? Uh, if you want to? What are the terms? Uh, I don't know. I'm thinking we can figure something out tomorrow. <laughs> Shit, this just got serious. Maybe I didn't impact, impart on you the level of cart playing we would be doing. What should we do after? I don't know. I don't know if that sounds weird to say. I'd like that. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> yeah, it'll be fun. <laughs> ah. See, <laughs> I feel like this could definitely be taken in a very wrong way. I'm just, I'm just gonna put that out there. You know, saying that you poked somebody. <laughs> I, uh, I really like you, Brayden. I really like you too, Emily. You got me smiling like an idiot over here. I'm in a similar predicament. So is tomorrow, I don't know, like, something? I don't know, you tell me. I don't know, I don't know, I know what it could be. I guess I'll just put myself out there. Brayden, I like you, like, way more than a friend. I have feelings for you, too. Do you wanna, like, date and be together? If you want to, yeah.
I may have just screamed in real life. Mm. <laughs> I heard it. No. <laughs> so I guess uh, this makes me your girlfriend. I guess, I guess that it does. It's about time. I've only had a crush on you for like a few months. Oh, ow, my hand. Haha, <laughs> really? I'm like so stupidly happy right now. Well, that makes two of us. Should we make this, like, face nook official? I'm gonna say, what do you mean? And hope that it gets me to her choice, because I don't know. Yeah, there we go. Update our relationship status. How about you choose? I say, yeah, why not? <laughs> Your relationship request? I can't think of anything more romantic than a formal request to be your girlfriend. <laughs> Would you look at that? So official. I know. Someone like you and all you know and how you speak. Evelyn, it's not going to take this very well. And don't mind me, I'm just posting a cryptic status. Not so cryptic with all these context clues. Shh, it's a secret. Sorry, Matt, can't hang tomorrow. I already got some plans. What the hell? I can't stop smiling. <laughs> Would you knock that off? <laughs> oh shit, my dad just walked into the room. Once he used the computer. <laughs> Fight him! <laughs> but why? <laughs> he knows something's up. He was like, what are you so smiley about? <laughs> Quick, hide. I'll see you tomorrow. For our cart competition. Absolutely. And remember, no buys. I'm sticking around. It can't be helped. New status available to post. It's feeling pretty fucking great. Couldn't stop smiling if he tries. Is going to bed thinking of you. Log out and end this chapter. <laughs> That's going pretty well, isn't it? <laughs> I'm just... A little worried about Evelyn. Because there's no way she's gonna take this very well. I don't know. Chapter 2. Oh my god. Okay, okay, hold on. I want to read this in order. Chill out. Okay. Oh god, that's the last season. Braden, you and Emily? And you didn't even need me to wingman? <laughs> Wii remotes. Fun fact! I, uh... I found literally just some random broken Wii remote just in my drawer. I don't know why. It doesn't work. I've already tried it. It's very... Batteries very much so leaked, but um, I lost, but maybe I just let Brayden win. It's because I'm too good.
too much of an, an epic gamer. Yeah, I can talk. Meet me at my lockers after last period. Matt was supposed to be Michael Sarah, but he forgot and got a hostile a hot dog costume. I'm in Braden is Tinker Tink and Pan. Blech. Good times with good friends. One month with you. Matt is now listed as single. You and Emily are together. You made it face knuck official, so everyone knows. Everyone also knows about Matt and Kelly. Oh no. Well. I guess that's where we're gonna end this episode. <laughs> yeah, so a lot happened in this episode. Especially there at the end. It's pretty eventful, as you can, you know, see. <laughs> Um, so yeah, especially now that, you know, uh, Emily and I are, you know, public and official, I'm just very worried about how this conversation's gonna go. Because, yeah, based on the timeline, if that's one month, it would have been, yeah, three days before she responded to this. I don't know. Just a little worrying, I guess. Anyway, though, I'm gonna end this episode because uh, my recording's already uh, just under an hour and a half long. An hour and 23 minutes. So, um, yeah, I enjoyed this. Alright, so, um, I hope you guys like this video and I'm... I know I took a, a very long break from it, but I'm excited to be back, and I'm hoping to not take another break from it. So, yeah, I'm excited for what happens next. Um, alright, so, uh, yeah, I hope you guys like this video, and bye! <laughs>Ah, for real though, I have so much freaking hair. God, I need a haircut. <laughs> oh, God, I hit myself in the eye. Ouch. <laughs>